Hey guys, the Cube Dude here, and today I have an unboxing from Meffords.com. So this package, I actually think I know what's in it. You probably can tell from the title of this video. I think this is the four Metal Ghost Cubes that I ordered one to two months ago. So I'm pretty excited considering how I love the green one from the Jade Club, and I can't turn it that much because my address is on the other side, but uh, I absolutely love the metal one. I got a PB of uh, 220 on it, so yes, yes, this is the metal one. So. I'm going to have someone on Skype help me with the colors of the blue and the purple, and her name is Zoe, and I'm not going to show you her, but here I have the four, there's uh, silver, gold, and I'm going to take my best guess after I get these out of the packaging, but, so I've gotten them all out, I've not done any turns on it, and Zoe is a witness, so I just took them all out, uh, so here's the gold, the gold next to the green, to me looks really, very similar. I actually probably won't be able to tell the difference between them, but they look the exact same to me, the gold and the green. But this is gold, the other one's green, I won't be talking about that. The silver one, pretty easy to tell. And I'll do first turns all at once, but this one, I'm going to guess it's purple. Zoe, give me a thumbs up. It's, there you go, this is purple. So, uh, I think Alex might be getting the purple one, I think he likes purple. Next, we have the blue, since that the purple. And let's just do first turns on this. So first turns... Turns really nice. I'm just gonna scramble it while I do it because it only takes like three minutes to solve for me. But moves really nicely out of the box. I think the metal ones, or the metalized, whatever the word is, uh, the metallic, I don't really know what to call them. You'll see that in the title of the video though. I think they turn a lot better out of the box than the actual stickered ones do. And I like these ones better because to me, uh, for me, the stickers just kind of distract me and this is just all one solid color. Try turning on the purple. I might drop like a few drops of Mario Lube in the purple one. It seems a little bit stiffer. More stiff. I don't even know if stiff is a word. Probably not. The one thing I noticed about the green is that you can't take out the center caps. Let's see if that's true. Or you can't take them off easily. I know that. Yeah, it's pretty hard to take off the center caps of the metal ones. Because sometimes when I'm solving on, like, let's just say, a stickered one, if I'm uh, orienting the centers, I know how to do them, I just am too lazy to do them. Unless I'm doing a time solve, I'll actually do them, but usually I'll just take off the center and just, uh, well this is really luby. It actually feels really weird. And it seems like two pieces are glued together. So for some reason, the silver one's really hard to turn. I don't know why, I thought a piece was like glued together, but this is really hard to turn, so I'm gonna have to take it apart and like re or put it back together but it's a really pain in the butt to turn not going to turn it, turn that one anymore next we have gold very smooth Let's scramble this i think i'll have a walkthrough solve of me uh, solving the green one one day soon i graduate today or whenever i'm recording this june 9th so pretty excited for that and then that means that I'll have lots of videos out soon because I don't have any graduation stuff to really worry about. But here are all the Metal Ghost Cubes. They look really nice. And if you want to see them all mixed together into one, you can check out RedKB's channel. He mixed all of them into one. I might do that, but um, I'm not sure. As you guys know, Ghost Cubes are my favorite types of puzzle. So the more Ghost Cubes, the better. But now, let me just quickly grab all my Ghost Cubes and show you all of them side by side. Alright, so here we have all my ghost cubes. We got the silver with the silver. We got the gold, the gold, white on, or black on white, black on white, white on black, matte gold on black, uh, green, blue, purple, and silver. And um, yeah, the handmade one there. So there's all my ghost cubes. And not sure if I'll be getting any more since that's all of them. I really want them to make a red one, a red metal one, because red's my favorite color. If you guys didn't know that. So I'd highly recommend you guys go out and buy these. I'm not sure if the silver, all the silver ones are like this, but this one is. Maybe it's the amount of lube they put in. Maybe they didn't even work it in. I don't really know what they do, what they did wrong with that one. But all the other ones look nice. Actually, the silver one looks nice, but all of them look nice. Scrambled. I'm really satisfied with this whole order except for the silver. However, I will fix that soon, probably after my graduation. But I can't wait to go ahead and solve these. The trick is, uh, or one trick, solve this side first. I'll show you on the gold to make it easier. Solve not this center first, because these two pieces will look the exact same. You want to solve this one. 
because on this side, the ones, the pieces you want to look for are the small straight sides, so that one. I'll actually just go ahead and do the cross for you. So I got that one, wrong way. You got that piece. Then you look for the longer, the longer edge looks like that, and that goes on the opposite side of that. Then you look for that edge with the little triangle right there, and the rest is just flat. And that one goes right. Turn. Okay, turn with me, ghost cube. That one goes there. Then the next one you want to look for is one like this, but on the corner there's a small triangle. So this one. This one you can see has a small triangle. Let's get it to zoom in on our focus. It has that really small triangle. And then that one goes on the opposite side of that. And then just like that, you have the cross. And actually, I'll just go ahead and solve the whole entire first layer. I know this corner goes right here because that's like the weird corner. It doesn't fit in any other uh, spot. Then next to uh, this, uh, this one will be a triangle. Is this the right one? You have to kind of feel because two of them feel the exact same. I, I believe that's the right one. And then on this corner, the one, the next one, you're going to look for the piece that looks like this. So there's a bunch of corners that look like that. I'll show you another one. Here's one that has uh, three different sides, but this one has a small triangle. The one that goes here has the big triangle. So I know that this piece goes there. And then I know here, this is the smallest corner you could find, so I believe it is this one right here. This one appears to be the smallest. So there we go, there is the first layer of the ghost cube. Alright, so I hope you guys all enjoyed this unboxing from Mefferts.com. If you have any questions, feedback, or suggestions on how to improve my videos, please let me know in the comments below. Please leave a like and read the description for the letter word winners. This video's letters are LBC. Read the description if you are confused about what these letters are for. Discounts and coupons can be found in the description as well. I hope you all enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn.